guys, I'm Callie Lewis. And I'm John P. Welcome to our behind the scenes tour here at CES 2014. You guys have been watching the coverage and hopefully loving it. Hopefully. But everybody's asking, what's going on behind the scenes? How are you set up and what's, uh, we want to know more. So we're going to show you. That's First right. of all, uh, that's the booth. That you is a see. ridiculous, gigantic booth. It's pretty awesome. I mean, I got to admit, it's 15 by 30. That big banner up there at the top, it's actually four foot by 20 foot wide. Your face and is gorgeous, John. Whatever. Look it's at like that. 15 feet high. You don't even want to think <laughs> about what we had to do to get that up there. Like, <laughs> people almost lost their lives. Oh, please. <laughs> well, if we're in there looking out, you can see our neighbors. Um, yeah. We've got Earthquake over here. Yeah, we got the Earthquake guys over here. Look at all this stuff they've got set up and they've been making a n nice rumbling they because have, they do subwoofers indeed. and stuff. And Look at this gigantic oh subwoofer, my okay? Goodness. That's so anyway, but and it hasn't been bothering the show Over here we have anything. the uh, Z-Wave Alliance, so all sorts of uh, different like a, a, a billion companies products that there. are doing using Z-Wave. So they're showcasing here. They're great neighbors hey, as well. Hey, did you ever notice that the that the, the p pathway looks like a little road? Yeah, that way you know which way to go left and right. Cool. All right, let's go um, let's up go above here. the We've stairs. We've got people everywhere, of course. <laughs> but we're got at CES, you have to make your way through a lot of people. And uh, at CES, there is, um, well... It requires a lot of battery because your phone dies quickly. So I actually use the Sadio case. It's an extended battery life case. 4,800 milliamps keeps me And of course, Sadio being one of our sponsors, one yes. of the things we did, we have this giant truss, but you'll notice we put these nice little banners. These, I think these are cool. The truss itself. I think those are cool too. The, the truss is made of two inch thick tubular steel. Ooh, and then we that have That just these, sounds fancy. It is. We have these little clamp things with these two inch poles and they made the banners and see they sew the banners so that they slide on over these poles. Nice. And these poles belt and they clamp on here and bolt on here like they will not go anywhere, okay? So, so that's cool. So we put our sponsors yeah. on the banner. Thanks we to love Sadio and BusyWig, Busy QNAP. QNAP. Thanks to Ustream, New Tech, and the CEA. All right, so then this table is James's home base. I don't know where James is at the moment. I think he He's went to go get food. lunch. Ooh. He's getting our food. Food? I want yeah. some food. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so basically so he stands up. here. Yeah, people come with like. I'll play James. You play the exhibitor. Why, hello, James. Those are very orange shoes you have on. <laughs> he wears orange shoes so that everybody can tell him apart from everybody else here at CES. I would like to be interviewed by... Callie Lewis, please. All right, why don't you come up here? Nice, okay. And that's how it goes. And then we bring them here up on stage. We have little steps here. We come up on stage. This is where we've been living. <laughs> this now, is this is home. a mess, okay? I'm going to show you the guts behind this, the, this situation, okay? So if you come over here, we've got a big power uh, strip hooked up here with all kinds of goodies. We've got this... Uh, USB power port here. We've got a little uh, headphone uh, amplifier kind of situation going on. This way, Callie and I can listen to what's called IFBs. They're little micro, the little headphones in our ears, so we hear what everybody's saying. And well, so it, these to guys can yell at us. Well, specifically the uh, control yeah. room. The yeah, Dave, Dave likes to yell and at Mark me. and Ken. That's what they do. They grab that. <laughs> they say dirty things in my ears. They really do. This is actually um, an HDMI to SDI converter because up here on the desk, we've been using our iPad as the close-up camera. And it's running VisiWig, and we've got it in a little iographer case, which is kind of cool. So actually, uh, we've gotten a few questions about why we're using that as opposed to a real camera. Um, and that's very simple because we we used a real camera once, and um, we had a lot of uh, connection issues. The, the cord kept falling out and everything. So we used the uh, iPad with the iographer because it gives us a really good way to easily get into the products, show you up close and personal. with. And Nice getting screen. in the way also and it's a huge screen we can see what we're shooting yeah. anyway so up here so we're standing here and we're looking at this okay over here we've got a control monitor so in this top corner we see what's actually going out and like Dave down there could or, or Mark can switch that camera that's the outside camera Mark can you show us some of there we go Hi. there's a there's camera number three here so we've got that's three two. different cameras two cam here we've got three. that now over there, that's called the preview monitor area. That's what 
That's what would be coming up next. Okay, so we can see. Oh, I see, see lunches here. If they were staged. Oh, lunch is here. So, All right. And then, <laughs> and then over here. And then over here. So yeah. we, can, we can keep track of our 15 minute marks, you know, because the segments are 15 minutes long. And then on this, uh, this monitor, uh, we have the chat room. So as you can see, they're seeing us go live as Dave was switching the camera and they're starting to say hi. Yeah, that's you um, guys. And we love being able to hear from you guys, the audience, while we're talking to exhibitors because you may have questions that we haven't even thought about and so we love to hear your comments um, these the are the way, mics oh yeah go ahead that we're using for everybody uh, what are what's the brand they're like they're they're a no-name brand but they're countrymen they're co like countrymen, countrymen style yeah so we put them on they go like this here I gotta put my mic down <laughs> all right so on. he's putting it over his ears and then these uh, the mic is actually quite adjustable so it's thin enough so you can move it around so if somebody has a thinner or wider face or anything or hair getting in the way you can adjust that the worst thing about being up here on stage is staring at these lights i mean they're really <laughs> bright you see we got four of them up there it doesn't and even then, bother me anymore yeah, i think my eyes are burned yeah, all you can see is leds behind us we've got these lights back here these are called hair lights believe make it or your not hair, hair look lights. beautiful they're not really for your hair what they're for is when the cameras are there and they're pointing this way and we've got a lot of depth behind us, the light helps kind of uh, make it more three-dimensional. It, 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 without those lights behind you, it looks like a very flat, you can't tell distance very well. So believe it or not, they help with that. And then of course we have our uh, sponsor TVs right here. So behind our heads, you can uh, make sure that you're uh, given props to our sponsors the again. over the shoulder shots. Okay, let's go down and work our way through the booth. There's James, There's James. the man making oh, it all look happen. look at the shoes. Thank you so much, we, James. Oh, you're very welcome, it's been fun. You have been fantastic. Yep. Oh, look at the shoes down here. That's what we were talking about. Yep. That's how everybody knows it's you, right? <laughs> Makes it easy for people to find me. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. Well, right. thank you for everything. Coming around here, we'll look at all the stuff that we use to control it. Well, uh, this is kind of a vital part. Yeah, somebody, I cleaned this up. Who put these here? I don't know, but <laughs> this is our rolling cabinet of goodness. So down at the bottom here, we have our TriCaster. I'm not actually allowed to touch these things, <laughs> but there's a TriCaster. There's like a, like a, hundred, a whole bunch of hard drives in it and stuff. Anyway. Um, there's all kinds of mixers and whatnot. We use a smart video hub. This is a black magic design. Every camera, everything we have comes into here and goes out of here. And so we can send any signal to any monitor and all that. We got four different Skype machines. We call them the Skype machines. But right now these are running things Actually, like- Actually we call it Skypezilla. We do. As a whole. One of these runs that chat room you were just looking at. Yeah. One of these is doing recording. We use them for whatever. And we've got these preview monitors here. And then up here, we've got our QNAP. This is our um, the 470 that we were talking about previously. It is running. What's happening is all of the videos that we're shooting are being dropped into the cloud station there and made available for everyone else immediately the second we're finished shooting well, them. So basically, like this computer, um, we have it running. As we're recording, we hit start, stop at each segment. That set if I understand correctly, yeah. this is sending straight to the QNAP. That's right. We're using a black magic media encoder here. So it's we're hitting start and stop. We, we start recording the video. It records it onto the Skype machine, one of these Skype machines, but it's just a computer. It's recording it onto one of these machines. Then as soon as the video is finished recording, it automatically syncs to, to the, the cloud. QNAP. And that QNAP then makes it available everywhere. So and we'll show you the end part of that over there. Yeah, we can there. show you that. So uh, they've got all sorts of computers running all sorts of different things. Mark and Ramsey, this is our big Mark Ramsey working the uh, TriCaster. How's it been going, Mark? It's been swell. Are we difficult to uh, keep up with? Not too difficult. All right, well, Not that's good to difficult. know. Not too difficult. This is our big mixer. He's he's running. Um, as I say, turn up the volume. Yep, he's got Make to work go to all, 11. That is a lot of knobs. Oh, I like that reference. Uh-huh. <laughs> so he's watching on all these monitors. He's got a big TriCaster control deck there. Let's him switch oh, that between control board everything. Is beautiful. Ooh, I like Ooh. the little knob. The, ah. Watch it transition. He he moves the knob and it just transitions from one to the other. I nice like and smooth. It. Pretty. Dave Curley here. Dave, how do you think the show's been going? 
Uh, I have not had any stress, and that is a what? good, good, good thing. It's been you we'll, haven't we'll had try stress. Oh, next yeah, time. exactly. We haven't put enough smooth. on him. Very smooth. I'm quite surprised, <laughs> astounded, actually. Yeah, no. Uh, no, we actually are very surprised. I mean, this this whole stream has gone without a hiccup. Um, I should say that right before we start the, today's the stream, day. but um, you know, yeah. it's uh, it's been fantastic. Okay, now over in this area, we call this the bullpen. Okay, we've got <laughs> <laughs> because of all the bull, because of all the bull going on in this pen. Um, we've got these desks here. We've got about room for about ten or twelve people, and these guys have been sitting here working nonstop. Over here is Dave Peterson, the editor in chief of Geek Beat. Hi there. What you been doing? Oh, I've been trying to get the videos up on YouTube as fast as we can. John promised a fire hose of information, and that is what it's been. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. nice. Well, he is responsible for making sure you guys have content, as are these guys. Ken, our engineer, he's a. Uh, well, I think he's relaxing a little happen. bit right How's now. It, how are you feeling today, Ken? I'm tired. That's about as much as we ever get out of Ken. So that's that's Ken. Marcus, uh, how many how many bags of chips does that make for you? Maybe twenty so far. Way more. No. Today. No, no, over the week. It's not too bad. They're Marcus good. loves They're his chips. chips. So we keep everybody supplied in food and chips. We'll show you that in a second. But also, let's talk about a little bit of the infrastructure we yep. got going on here. Because lots of power. Because we have USB charging ports there. We've got power there. Under, Ken, we got to back you up. Look at what's under the table. There is a rack under the table with switching equipment, routers. We got to, like an industrial router. And, and there's a, a Kevin. <laughs> Kevin down, down there, there <laughs> demonstrating. <laughs> We've got a couple of 12 ports, uh, power plug things down there, plus found the one up here. No, he found do, a lifesaver. Do saver. not eat it. That, <laughs> that violates the five second rule. Right. We also have, um, what is this uh, little a, hub that, that we've been saying. using? That's what It's a USB, it's a yeah, USB yeah. hub. That's From four 2.4 uh, amp uh, full power USB ports. We got we got some things like that going on. Where is that? Oh, Where's the QNAP. Oh yeah, and also you know we were talking about how we can uh, how when we record things get dropped onto the QNAP. Well, this computer we are looking at our recordings file here. So, so every can, single computer on this network can access all of these files. And we can play it right there. I mean, here's Ralph. Don't break it. <laughs> I'm not allowed to touch these things. But you see, I mean, we can just, this is, we're playing this right off the QNAP through our gigabit and it's network. It's not buffering and or anything. Even. It's fantastic. That's crazy. So we do have a lot of Wi-Fi here. Um, we got, well, um, in terms of internet connection, we got five gigs. Uh, well, no, megs, you mean? I mean, no, megs, we, sorry. We asked for six megs. Did we they, ask for six? We asked for six. They gave us like 20. Did they really? Yeah, we've been having fun. That's why. Oh, no wow. one said a word, okay? Okay, shh, shh don't tell anyone. That's okay. awesome. An army runs on its stomach, and so we have been bringing in every day Earl, Earl of sandwich. sandwich. If you guys are ever in Vegas, uh, definitely. I mean, they're everywhere. Look, I, that's I don't know Daniel where they Rubino. Yeah, Daniel, they have hey, been labeling Daniel, them for here's us. Your, here's your sandwich. There's your sandwich. And, and food comes to, and with delivery service from the bag, Powerless, the bags apparently. of chips. And yes. we keep the cooler with the drinks iced down. And this is the funny part, okay? You're not really supposed to be bringing in outside food. Shh, don't tell anyone. It's the last day. What are they going to do? So what we've been doing is we've been smuggling it in. <laughs> These are our light cases, <laughs> okay? These are our light cases. These are big pelican <laughs> cases. Okay, and what we did was we took all the stuff out of them, so it's just a big empty. So the guys take a pair of these out there and they <laughs> load. Smuggle they the meet food the, in. All the sandwich guys next door load these things up and just roll them in. Like, oh yeah, I we're just bringing in the equipment. Believe Bring. you just told the world hey, that you this is behind, behind the, the scenes. scenes. This is what we have to do. Oh, and they it. provide us with all sorts of trash cans, so we're constantly filling those up. Yeah, one last little here. thing I guess we could talk about is. We've got these uh, monitors and speaker. These are these Samson. We love these Expedition Express blue Bluetooth kind of yeah, speakers. They're awesome. amazing. But we've got the TV back here so that the guys working in the bullpen, who are full of bull, can watch <laughs> what's going on. And we've got chart beat going on here yep. so they can see what the articles are that are popular that, that are being worked on right exactly. now, right? Numbers aren't high enough. Blog more, blog more. Blog yeah. more, people. Blog more. You need more. to get the whips out. <laughs> And so that's pretty I mean, much it. Did we leave out anything? I mean, guys, did we leave out anything? All right, I, think I we're guess good. that's it, guys. 
Hope you enjoyed our little tour of the booth. Hope it wasn't too long and boring for you. If you have any additional questions that we didn't cover, just feel free to ask. Leave a comment below, and uh, one of us will get back to you. I'm Callie Lewis. I'm John P. And that's the team Thanks bringing you watching. CES Live. Bye. Bye, guys.